Okay, so what I have for you today is something that a few people have asked me about, which is uh, adapting an OEM V8 Ford throttle cable uh, to different setups. Now this is a this is a factory Maverick V8 cable. Uh, it's got a little plastic stop for the pedal, two bolts for firewall mounts, and then the single bolt that would normally go in this L bracket that mounts on your intake manifold. Um, but you can't adjust this, so the only way that you can move this pivot point is by moving this one back here. And uh, sometimes it doesn't work out. Uh, the intake manifold is not tapped for the right spot uh, or you have a spacer. So what you can do is you can just pick up one of these, which is just a super simple um, aftermarket bracket. And it has adjustment in the rear. And uh, this one in particular has, I like because it's got a double return spring in the front. And uh, mounting it is super simple. You just set it down and you slot the cable in just like you would to the factory bracket. And then there is a single machine screw, goes in. You tighten that up. And then it mounts on the studs that would be on the driver's side of the carburetor. Really, really simple setup. So you just drop it on your studs, connect your cable. You can adjust this front and rear to make sure that you don't have any binding uh, in here. And then set up your return spring. And it has this one has this nice little button that sandwiches the return spring into the carburetor. And uh, it's just a really nice, clean way to do it uh, that doesn't involve trying to fabricate a bracket. And then you've got to have a separate return spring bracket either on your carburetor, mounted on your intake manifold, or maybe to your valve cover bolt. Uh, this will do it all in one. And uh, it's, a, it's a pretty clean little setup in the end. Uh, I highly recommend it. They're not very expensive. Let me know if you guys have any questions uh, or if this helped you out, and we'll see you next time.